We're still in the desolation wilderness. This is night vision video, and uh, this is some of the roughest terrain. I swear, I mean, the rocks are just killing my ankles because there's piles and piles of granite to climb over. Small pieces, large pieces, your feet slip all over. Uh, they put these railroad ties in, you know, to prevent, to get, to get, give hikers a little bit of a, a step up. You know, keep the rocks from shifting. Uh, water comes down, of course, in the spring. This is insane. And we have lake. I mean, there's there's drop-offs or steep hills going down low, going down into near some of these lakes. And like I said earlier, there's a lot of lakes. Yeah, night vision doesn't really do justice because we're in such an area. We're walking. We are surrounded by rocks. We got rocks almost on both sides. These, the ones to the right are starting to simmer down and it just drops off down a hill. Anything could be out there. I hear a lot of stories about this place and uh, you can't go wrong camping here, but the thing is, this is wilderness. People get eaten by bears out here. Black bears attack. Actually, they get mauled. And uh, you have to have a good fire, a good gun, possibly your dog. Things of that sort will keep your safety level at a minimal. But, uh, you know, we did a lot of hiking today. And I'm so proud, and I, you know, the kids worked so hard. Everybody works hard to hike. And, uh, we all got our own little stories to tell about places like these. Whether we love them, hate them, whether the hike's easy, hard, we're all going to have our own stories. And, uh, I see dragonflies flying around here at night. That's kind of interesting. I did find some mysterious things up here. And, uh, you know, people could say, hey, you know, you still can't prove this stuff exists. But, uh, you know, that's what we're here for. If you don't go out and you don't put yourself in the predicament, you're not going to have a chance of seeing something like Sasquatch. But you increase your chances by going out to secluded places like this in the day at night, and uh, you have to understand that those increased chances allow us to gather evidence like footprints, maybe even hear samples, you know, uh, just things of that sort, because if I get hear samples, I'll go to the university and we can have those tested at the university, but uh, it's endless rocks, I mean, I see the stars coming out. But, you know, we're still dealing with two to three more miles back to our vehicle. And I got root beers back at the vehicle for the kids. And Tammy, cold root beers. I did that on purpose as a reward for the hike. But, um, and I know the videos are kind of dark now that it's night out, but it allows me to connect with my viewers and just, you know, let you know I'm alive and I'm working hard for you guys. And, uh, it's unfortunate that so many TV networks have contacted me and almost nearly promised me a show that I could get on and, you know, work with Sasquatch, work with Ghost, kind of show you guys some of my talents and what I know and what I've learned, and I think people can learn off of me. But, unfortunately, there's a lot of competition, and, uh, every year we get contacted by two, three producers, whether it's from YouTube or whatever, and, uh, people don't realize that, you know, we are a hardcore extreme adventure group because we're out here in the desolation wilderness at night and during the day. You know, we're hiking miles and miles in and we're digging deep for this creature. We are going off the beat trails, too. And, uh, we're digging deep. And we want producers and TV networks to know that, uh, we're the type of group you want. We're going to give you adventure, laughter, excitement, and we're going to bring you to worlds that you never knew existed. Uh, it's break time. I'm going to shut the camera off. Wow. Hello, everyone. Hi, Dad. All right, I was just filming a movie. Yeah. All right, I got to fly, man. Uh, this is a little break of the Paranormal Ghost Society doing night vision on the Echo Lake Trail in the Desolation Wilderness. Pretty strange.